This afternoon we are here yet witness the second send of ceremony of retiring generals. Last year we were here for such a ceremony. He headed the ant smuggling unit, which was called the Special Revenue Protection Service. The general was appointed member of the Organization of African Unity. The first retiring general, sir, is Resistance Officer 00513, General Kale Kaihura. The story of the of, of the of the UPDF NRA is a miracle, a miracle story, where something small. That's why the book I wrote was entitled "Sowing the Mustard Seed." How something small can grow into a mighty tree. But General Kare has given a very good summary of it. It all came from from fighting for a just cause fighting for something just and doing it properly without making mistakes. Because some of the people make mistakes. Either they do too much or they took and do things prematurely. But in our case, we are always taking uh, scientific steps. We didn't do anything that was adventurous. No. We only did what was doable at the time. That's why we talk of a protracted war where you fight battles of short duration but in a war of a long duration. The battles, when we were still small, had to be of short duration. We could not afford protracted battles because we didn't have the ammunition to fight one battle for a long time. So the battles had to be of short duration, but within a war of long duration. The war is long, but the battles are short. So combining the, 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 the justness of the cause, of the cause, the justness of the cause, and the correctness of the strategy, and the correctness of the tactics, all of them must be correct. Strategy correct. Strategy means covering the whole from A to Z. And that's how we succeeded. And General Kare has brought it out well that the, 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 the good force we built up, the strong revolutionary force we built up, did not only rescue Uganda, but somehow contributed to some situations in the region, in the region of, of the Great Lakes. So therefore, I really congratulate you for belonging to such a glorious force. And making your own contribution to it. Because it's sort of the many problems of your people. When you look at the economy now, the, the, it's a totally different story from what it was in 1986. And it is even a different story from what's happening in the world, even today if you compare with the whole world, not just in the past. Because like now, if you look at inflation, inflation here now is 3.9% last time when I checked. But in many countries in the world, inflation is very high. People don't have food in many parts of the world. And this is really due to the mistakes made by, by, by the leaders. So I therefore congratulate you, and you should also congratulate yourself because you, you, you belonged to a glorious force, a force that has. 
Now, this retirement, do not regard it as becoming redundant now. Not, not at all. This is, this is like a mutation from one form of service to another one. And that's why we had to hold on retirement until we had solved the problem of the package. The, 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 the entanda you go with. When you retire, what, what entanda, what, what do you go with? And I can assure you what you're going with now, as the minister was saying, is, is, is considerable. UPDF is there in the background. When you get established in the society and you, you, you produce, they can be buying from you, they can be, you, you should, the, the, the people who are managing the army should, should have relationship with the veterans. If they produce something that is needed by the army, you should buy from them. So therefore, I congratulate you, and it's now my honor to send you off in, glo in glory and in dignity. Thank you very much. African Community Secretariat in Arusha. He acted as Army Chief Lieutenant General Takara. Major General Samuel was from Texas Salongo for receipt of certificate of service. Isuga <laughs> Wakiso District. The general attended several schools where to 2014. Major General David Kaumawakalo underwent military training of Hachibale Village, Kibasi Parish. Hachibale sub African Union Medal, Independence Jubilee Medal. Brigadier General Stephen Oluka underwent military training and among the courses he attended, 